thousand planes. Jesus. But they're not all over the UK. One would hope. Oh, wonderful. Well, I'm slowly building up my air force. Okay. Yeah, we're just gonna need to. Um... All right. So I will put all fighters, and I will make a thousand fighters. Uh, for set for over the UK. Yeah. Meantime, I'll see what I can do about knocking. I'll take the edge of Sicily, put that back under my control, and then, and only then, once I'm done with it. Oh my God! I have so many civilian <laughs> factories. It's amazing. Um, once I'm done with this, I'll put myself on. Uh, Honestly, bro, you might, be, you might be our best bet. You and Poland are the only ones with a lot of naval ports. Yeah. The Austro-Hungarian Empire rises again. <laughs> hold on, hold on. There, There is something that is annoying me, so I'll deal with that a little bit later. Oh, yeah, I'll deal with that. Very By the way, bro, did, uh, Delta, did you guys ever look at the Black Sea and think of a Wraith firing a shot? Yes. Yes. Yes, I have. That's what I always thought of it when I looked at it. Alright, so how's the Russian campaign campaign going? It's going. Alright, because, uh... Yeah, Japan might have a second wind. Oh, wow, no, they're on resistance suppression. They're having a lot of issues with... Alright, that's good for us. Bad news is they still have 8 million men and 368 divisions. You know what sucks, though, is we're going to still have to deal with the Chinese... Yeah, but the Chinese are very, uh, they're, they're far smaller than the ones were, and they're basically like the They Russians. still have, like, fucking 10 million men, though. Yeah, but, but they, it's, you just need to murder, like, one guy, and you can stop most of them. Alright, anyway, uh, like I said, I will begin making paratroopers as well. I'll, I'm gonna be focusing on a... I'm focusing on tank divisions. Wonderful. So with all that, uh, my production's astounding. I'm gonna hit play, by the way. Alright. Um, I just need to get some tanks and roll. Yeah, right let, let's Spain take care of Africa, dude. Well, Africa is a major point. So we can get through. Basically, everyone down there is a major point. So we just gotta s just sweep all the way down. Also, my brother has Austro-Hungarian territory in Italy. I don't know how, but he does. Took it over from the French, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, things are not going very well in uh, Eagle in or, uh, Turkey. Yeah, well, we're, we're I'm pushing them off the west coast, so that's not the issue. It's the prime the the big. All right, I just need men right now. Honestly, our worst problem is just how many men we're fighting. But uh, if we do have one bright side, is the fact that the United Kingdom. They have 200 divisions. Yeah, they have they have very few. Yeah, well, if we knock out the UK, we're actually in a better position than the US. The okay. UK is really the only one that deals a large army, comparatively speaking. Well, right now, if we can close... Wow, Italy's coming back. 
Wait, how the hell am I down there? Oh. I honestly don't even know. Alright. Maybe because you took Italy, that was just assumed. Yeah, okay, S Spain's dealing with that. You guys... Hold off in Rome for the meantime. You guys uh, just stay in Warsaw. And you guys stay in Paris. And Republic of Guatemala. Okay. I'm doing full research into Navy. I'll start building a Navy, uh, a modern Navy pretty soon. I'm doing full research into heavy tanks, and I'll be able to roll. I'll be trying to push through. Um... I'm just trying to do a combination of everything. Here, bro. Focus on um. You oh, I. You focus on um. Where's Delta? What do you mean? He's dealing you, with you Turkey. Don't, you don't... You should probably start pushing against it down there. Down there, Turkey, dude. Again? You're not. We are. You're I'm not setting up a lot. Yeah, yeah, we can't fight them. There's too many units here. There's really a metatonic. I'm retaking the territory at the moment. Oh, good. Glad to know that. German Reich will fall. Oh. Against the German regime. That's wonderful. The Germans died like a couple episodes ago, dude. It's like. Um, a little late for that. A little bit. Alright, but anyway, right now I'm just mass production of items and transport. Yep. Here, bro, I'm, I'm researching destroyers. So what I'll try to do is focus on destroyers and submarines. You focus on, um... Well, I'm just trying to research everything right now. I had nothing researched. Alright, that should kind of be fixed, honestly. By the way, do you guys ever notice that the more fighting goes on in the territory, the more war torn? Alright, I am, uh... You ever notice that? Nope. Yeah, look, look at, look at, all, look all over, uh, East Ukraine, dude. You just see, like, tire tracks and whatnot. Do that, you see it? Oh, yeah, damn. Yeah. Yeah, like, in certain cities that we've gone over repeatedly are just destroyed. France looks actually pretty much unscathed. But yeah, Eastern, especially Eastern, like Russia, it's just all. It's just, it's just a bloody mouth territory. Austrian Gate Empire is just in. Really? I figured that the look, the Switzerland will probably join them. I'm just gonna deal with it. Yeah, fuck it. Right, my guards, troops, how are we doing? I need a hundred and nine. I have half the. God dang it. How's resistance? How's. Um, alright. Italy's fine, but the Europe's like. Well, especially France, like, French resistance. <sighs> alright. I'm gonna start trying to build a large uh, destroyer submarine navy. Yeah. I have a lot of stuff I need to repair, so I'll probably just go under that. Once cruisers are done, actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. Not much with the navy. Do I have anything else I can do? Carriers. Oh, I can. Okay, let's let's grab that. Nice push, you just And then we'll deal with the resistance. Actually, no, we're just repairing the resistance. I'm losing a lot of dudes from somewhere. I don't know where though. I'm looking. Nor Tur Turkey's still under fire. Uh. Spain is currently in Africa. I don't see anywhere else that we're currently located in. The United States is doing multiple invasions. Tons of transports on standby. That's awesome. Actually, have naval bombers. All right, that's cool. Anywhere else? Nope. All right, so we'll just keep those on. We'll stand by to help us with the channel. How many planes do I have right now? 700. Perfect. And then we'll get the next thousand planes. If I can get like four, maybe five thousand planes and just s start a campaign against Britain, then and with paratroopers as well, 
I should be able to do a nice landing. Alright. Yeah. Let's see what we got. I guess they just boost the allies between the axes, so it makes things a lot easier. Yeah, but I'd say we're the ones clearly winning. I'm still fine with my population. Where are you at right now? Oh, 400,000. So I don't lose that many men to really like be like, oh no, that's terrible. No. Time to expand the great Romanian oil fields. If I'm gonna be building a very large navy, then I'm gonna need a lot more oil. Oh shoot, they're sacrificing themselves like goddamn. Hold on, don't go there. I I'm good in this type of environment, actually. I've got a lot. Oh my god. Spain just tried to navally invade. I think it worked out too well. All right, let's get the fleet up before I start researching that. So let's get some uh, like cruisers. And of course, I, I uh, all right carriers, and then we'll work on uh, repairs. Oh, good. I'm still positive on guns. Resources. Yeah, I'm doing fantastic. I just have no axe. No port is open for, like, some of the really valuable resources that I need. Like what, what resources? Like, uh... Oil and rubber? Hold on. So rubber. Like Rubber is the big one. I'm making a bunch of uh, the industrial, like the synthetic factory fields. What the hell? I don't know what happened, but thank you, Switzerland. Uh, Switzerland just moved its entire army. I think because Spain moved over like 20 divisions, so it like focused all of its men on one area. God, Switzerland just got drowned out by a sea monster from Gary. It just, it was just an island that just. Yeah, Spain just came over with like 10 divisions. I think they were just redistributing somewhere else. And, uh, yeah, got, got, got an island. Okay, there guys, go. Switzerland's down. One of our greatest enemies. Oh, uh, goddammit. Eh. Oh god, knock out. Oh my god. Knock out Beirut. Focus all units on Beirut. Oh my god, look at all that. Alright, no problem. Like I said, work on repairs, get that. There out of we way. go, okay. That's a lot of. Yeah, we just murdered like. 10% of the Allies' army. Actually, I think I can fix this. So let's just put a bu bunch of oh guys in Oh my god, the Japanese are not in... Oh god. Oh! That's what's going on! What? Let's have them scattered in the line, so that way... The, uh... The, uh... The, uh... The, 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 uh, the Japanese are invading, uh, Africa. Th what? That's not... Yeah, that, 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 you see Italy's push? That's all Japanese forces. No, you think I think it's those six divisions the Italians have. They're really doing it. You're being smart. I don't, I'd appreciate it. All right, let's see. How's resistance going? There we go. That With all those troops down there, hopefully that quiets those resistance locations. A little bit.
tank production go. At least in the bigger territory, so it's quiet them down. Shoot. This is gonna be a lot more difficult. Hey Delta, can you increase the infrastructure in this area? Where? Over in, uh, like, Palestine. Oh my Jerusalem. god, the resistance! Israel, this area. See where we are, like, the, the, where we're fighting right now. Can, yeah. you, can you increase the infrastructure? Because right now we're suffering heavy attrition because of it. Yeah. If you get more naval ports uh, over here, get more infrastructure, we'll be able to increase more damage. Quickly reinforce. Oh my god, actually, everyone boost uh, faster than me. Oh, good. Everyone ba boost faster than the US. If we can do a massive uh, fascist coup, we don't need a, ma a large army. We just need to just sail across the ocean blue and fight into our faction. Okay, then, then, we'll have a, then we'll have a puppet US on our side. I mean, what do you think I've been doing by boosting them. Well, I'm making it known because uh, it's a common strategy I've noticed that people say think think to do things but don't tell anyone about it. I, I don't know what you're talking I've been telling people this whole time. No, not quite this story. <sighs> Where are you guys located? You're down here. Alright, same thing. Hey, I'm yep. gonna focus on building modern armor for my army, okay? Because I have probably more armor than you guys. I'll focus on that, because I'm close to unlocking it. Okay, Romania? Wait, what's up? I'll focus on getting modern armor to deal with the war on the okay? Okay. Alright, so that is helping at least kind of reduce resistance in key areas. I'll take it. Speaking of which. Do I have military? I have military police with them. Yeah, the, the UK. Yeah, they're uh, they're getting starved out. You're gonna massacre a lot of troops because they don't have any ports. Japanese took the only uh, Russian port that they uh, have access to. So all the units you're fighting GTA are slowly attrition. Every single one of them. They don't even stand a chance. Also, I'm gonna kick it up a notch then. I'm gonna attack aggressively. There we go. Hopefully that increases the speed at which all this stuff can be repaired. There we go. I can see the boost happening right now. That way we can get all these factories done. Now I just have a lot of factories that need to get uh, repaired. You think I feel? Alright, so let's see, 14 divisions, go there. Still need way more men, but at least I'm holding a most fronts. Possible Japanese incursions. Yeah, just the possible ones. Let these paratroopers be a li little stronger. I know that's gonna take more time, but I'd rather have good paratroopers. Oh my god, stop it. We're dealing we're doing fine with the invasions. It's like they're invading! Yeah, no duh. Oh my god, enough. Should 
Speaking of which, how how big of a sp oh Spain is head? Go Navy. That would be correct. Yes. So. We have a total of nine ships in our combined navy. This is just listen. I am. And I've got. I've got quite a few. Details, but no, yeah. I am uh, currently. I'm, I'm maximizing my coastal output. I'm giving it all she's got to uh, increase my navy. I'm building tanks. I'm, 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 captain. I'm, I'm building tanks and I'm building. Um, Tanks and submarines, that's what I'm focusing on. I'm just gonna, once I get through all these, like, things I need that are currently being destroyed, um, I'm gonna jump over and, uh, make a few more of the supports. Uh, uh, Austro-Hungary is being invaded again. What? Or, sorry, Poland's being invaded again in the north. I'm setting 57 divisions to have them off in the right, Oh, yeah. shit. All right. Hold yeah. on. I'm pouring them in the west. In the east, I mean. <laughs> no worries. Once you I think I would have gotten more manpower from conquering land, but I just haven't. Yeah, no. Um, again, uh, the... Keep building, uh, keep building the, the, the infrastructure in, uh, this region. As well as, uh, more, as well as more, uh, ports that we can get, uh, resources in. Yeah, I'm just gonna hope they're just dying. Anyway. Uh. Alright, guards. Yep, there are currently 30 divisions in the north. It's very, uh, They invaded in Stetson, hoping to drop a wedge. To Let me know when you're ready to attack. Hey, you go, Slavia. You focus on gas. You ready to go? Um, yep. Infrastructure build in Russia for me, please. Russia. Yes, Russia. <laughs> they have all this fucking factory space, dude. <laughs> yeah, retreat out security. of the port that's bringing you supplies. That's a great idea. Why are you going into... There we go. Time to murder some more. Why are my guys leaving to go to a port? I thought losing men, they just go out into the water. What the heck? Can you forbade travel by water? Is that a thing? Alright, hopefully strategic redeployment option being on will make them be able to move fast and hopefully not kill themselves. Hopefully. Wow, the, that uh, 13 divisions of the UK. Dead. If they already have no limit in the amount of soldiers they can have, then there's really no real use. Essentially, it's like a upgrade for like field, uh, field marshal. So, if they already have, if they already can have like infinite amount of troops, then there's no point in promoting them. But if you, but let's say they can only have, can only have 24 divisions. If you promote them, then they can have as many divisions as you want. The only problem is after that, uh, you, they lose all the special abilities. They have like trickster and like you know other like little perks. You lose that. Then again, you also can you know put more, a lot more armies in there. Okay. I hope. Uh, yeah, bro. You should have plenty of civilian factories. I do, and they're mass, and uh, I have them pretty much all just repairing all of the stuff that just keeps being destroyed by the uh, resistance movements. Uh, you could, 
Go, yeah, are you on gentlest spot? Well, you could go with suppress. That might come. That might help you. Yeah, that's why I just switched to. Hopefully that reduces. All right, it's slowly being reduced. So. Huzzah. Oh my God. Fine. I just want to kind of shoot these people too. So, like, yeah. enough. Look at the army GTA is fighting. They're just attritioning to death. They're, they have literally no more men. They're running out of men. They're running out of guns. It's quite sad. Alright, well. I'm running out of men too. How many men do you have left? 860,000. I'm, I'm down to 250, man. I'm down to 21. I think this is a war we're gonna be able to win, boys. That's why we're focusing on tanks and such. Lems, look, uh, the major. What do you mean it's a war we can't win? Dude, oh, yeah. with, the, with the fight, like literally, like almost 30 million soldiers right now. Let, no, let's double check. So right now the Allies have a total field manpower of five million. We have seven. All right, they've lost nearly three million. We've lost all, uh, close to two. The Axis have nearly five million. Uh, no, I'm sorry, no, you know, six million manpower. That's all through Japan. Yeah, so, Japan and And then, uh, was it, um, we have, uh, once again, seven million. So, all in all, yes, to combined, they're, they, they, they outnumber us. But, if you look at it as a 1v1v1, or, you know, a free-for-all, we have the biggest out of the, uh, out of the th big three powers. We have mainland here pretty much in our, like, under our control. Like, it's locked down for the most part. So, I don't see how this could go bad. I, I truly don't. I, it's just, Spain is slowly pushing through Africa. I, we're, um, we're, we're now pushing through, uh, we're now doing a massive push against, uh, the, uh, Axis. Through the Middle East. Oh, that should help us. Actually, uh, we, how is Iran, speaking of Middle East? They are mostly fascist. They do have fascist yeah. revolutionaries. And though, so. honestly, the it funny enough, the Allies no longer have support in the Mediterranean to send supplies. The Italians, of all people, block them off with from the, with the Suez. So there you go. Yeah. I get a question: Do the Russians actually patrol the Caspian Sea with like I mean like with ma like a major? Army? Yeah. It's like a fleet that it's basically the only person you're fighting. Who is on the Caspian Sea? Let me look at the world map. Azerbaijan, Russian Federation, Iran. Yeah, none of those are exact. Oh no, it's actually the uh. Well, actually, yeah, no, Russian town. Bit of it. Huh. It's just I just find it kind of funny in that regard. It's like, who builds a navy? Like, whoever builds a navy on the Caspian Sea, you're basically fighting. There's not, there's not too right. many large powers. Alright, and at that point, I'll pause it and end this point. So, in case, I want to thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. I also want to thank my Patreon supporters like Leo, Sean, Tim, and Hercules. Thank you so much for your awesome support. This has been Grayshot17, Grayshot151, uh, GTA... And uh, collateral, fighting oh. as the what 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 alliance are we again? The Eastern. The e Eastern Union. The Eastern Union, against uh, the known world. So tune in next time to where, of course, we deal with Ch uh, Japan slash Japan controlled China, and eventually deal with the UK and the United States. But we'll see you guys next time. Later, guys.